It is an intimate portrait of the royal family of three. Baby Archie, just eight weeks old, held by his proud parents on the day of his christening. A private ceremony conducted by the Archbishop of Canterbury. It is the first time Archie's face has been clearly shown in public. In the second of the official photographs, he is surrounded by his grandparents, the Duke and Duchess of Cornwall, Meghan's mother Doria Ragland, and Princess Diana's two sisters, as well as the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge. Notably absent, though, is Archie's great-grandmother, the Queen, who did not attend because of a prior engagement. Behind the tall walls of Windsor Castle is where fewer than 25 guests were invited to witness the newest royal baptism, those invited taken discreetly to the tiny private chapel. Outside, though, the streets were thronging with people. Those hoping to catch a glimpse of the royal christening, though, were left disappointed. We do pay for the royal family, including uh, Meghan and Harry, and I think that they could have given us a little, you know, um, a little something. I think it should be public, you know, it always has been, why, why change it? It's their decision, it's their family, um, it's not as if they're direct uh, in line. And this royal watcher says the public may have to get used to this royal couple's desire for privacy. Well, it seems to be the case that Harry has decided he wants his little boy to have more of a private life. He feels he's a long way from the throne and wants to enjoy some type of privacy. But it could be a problem because no matter what you do, he is growing up in a royal goldfish bowl. He has got two of the most famous parents in the world. Today's christening is a very different royal event. Part of the continuing desire by the Duke and Duchess of Sussex to raise their son Archie out of the spotlight. And they're a couple determined to do things their own way. Striking the balance between pleasing the public while maintaining privacy won't be easy. Today, though, we'll be remembered for these happy family images. Sejal Karia, ITV News, Windsor.